And while thousands fled Afghanistan trying to build a new life, including hundreds coming here to Tulsa, one woman who's visiting Bartlesville this week is working to help those still there, specifically girls in school. Two News Oklahoma reporter Katie Kelleher shares how she's making sure Afghan girls are still getting an education. Razia Jean immigrated to the United States from Afghanistan in the 70s when she went back after 9-11, her first visit in more than 30 years. She saw a discouraging change for women and decided to do something about it. Razia Jean returned to her native country of Afghanistan after decades away and saw it wasn't the home she left. What I saw was that the girls were suffering so much. Razia started Razia's Ray of Hope and raised money for a school for girls in a rural village about 45 miles outside of Kabul. It opened in 2008 with about 100 students. And now, 13 years later, they have about 800 students and are still growing, even now offering a midwife program. There's about 40, 40 girls that will work within those communities um, uh, helping the women uh, and the children who are born. But things changed in August when the Taliban took over the country again. Girls were out of school until certain security measures were in place, like being separated from the boys, which isn't a problem for Razia's all-girls school. The kindergarten through sixth graders were able to return to class in September, and they're hoping the seventh through twelfth grade girls can come back next week. I think the changes um, might come with with the regime change, but I'm willing to accommodate them, uh, the Taliban, so my girls can go to school. Razia plans to return to Afghanistan to visit the school soon. She hopes to even meet with leaders of the district to ensure the girls can keep learning. Giving them education has really um, proved something to that community that uh, it is worth giving girls education. Razia is in Bartlesville this week, fundraising with the Bartlesville Daybreak Rotary and sharing her mission, which is now more important than ever. Just to give them, continue, you know, giving them education and, and make it possible for them to become something uh, one day. If you'd like to support Razia's school, there is a fundraiser here for it in Bartlesville on Friday. You can also donate online. We'll have that information for you on our website, kgrh.com. In Bartlesville, Katie Kelleher, 2 News, Oklahoma.